So what is this study's question? Can semaglutide reduce cardiovascular events in people who are obese and, hold on, don't have diabetes? Don't have diabetes, but do have known cardiovascular disease. That was the key population here. Yeah. So let's find out what the study said. So 17,000 adults. Yeah, that's big enough. And what did they find? Yeah, so after 40 months, so one, two, three, it's a weird 40 months. Like, why did they go three years and a bit? I'm sure there was a bit of fluffing to... Uh, to get to the right months to get something valid. <laughs> Not out of an industry-funded trial, really? Yeah, no, they never do that. Okay. No, it's like a parent-funded study. <laughs> <laughs> Earlier sleep is better. Yeah. Uh, cardiovascular events, death from all cardiovascular causes, uh, non-fatal MI or stroke, occurred in 6.5% of the people on semaglutide, and then 8% with placebo. That's right. No difference in mortality. Mortality was the same, but the semaglutide group was probably a bit happier because 9% of them lost weight versus only 1% in the placebo group. 